Governments are always looking for new technology to help find criminals. An innovative tactic that's now being used to solve some of the country's biggest cases is being featured on a new show airing tomorrow right here on ABC. And a tri-state native is behind the new method in a big way. Jake Boswell with more on the genetic detective. We got the DNA and we can't find him. How do you find a needle in a haystack? To catch a killer. It's the toughest assignment for police agencies around the country. They followed every lead, the police. New technology is now answering more questions and finding more murderers than ever possible before. It's a story that begins in the tri-state in Bone Gap, Illinois. It, it's nothing that I ever expected to do when I was growing up. Paula Gawthorpe Armentrout grew up in the small town in Edwards County before going to college and beginning a career out of state, a career that's led her here. Parabon Nano Labs. What we're doing for law enforcement, a lot of people think we just popped up overnight. We didn't. This is a long time coming and many, many years of hard work. The company she co founded first worked with the U.S. Department of Defense in 2011 using DNA to find suspected terrorism. The company later began to work with local law enforcement after beginning a new partnership. In 2016, our, our paths crossed. CC Moore, just an ordinary citizen, she solved our case for us. CC Moore now works for Paula and Parabon. She's helped pioneer genetic genealogy the company's using to help solve crimes like one very close to home. I mean, this person was not anywhere in the original case file. A cold case of a woman murdered in Terre Haute sat unsolved for 47 years. Parabon's lab was given DNA from the crime scene last year. Using their technology, it was analyzed, and a suspect's likely appearance was created. We can tell you eye color, hair color, skin color, freckling on the face, shape of the face. And we can also tell you very deep ancestry information. Then the mapping of a family tree was laid out to narrow down the suspect, pointing police in a direction they never would have thought before. It was the genetic genealogy specifically. This is what you'll see on The Genetic Detective. A show that stars CC and Parabon as they help solve crimes. As for Paula, she may be seen with the company's co-founder, her husband, who's featured. I agreed to be in the background on some of the shots um, that were done here in the Reston office of Steve, that's my husband. From Bone Gap to national TV, Paula's proud to be featured on such a big stage, but she's even more proud of where she's from. I learned to be a hard worker and to have a good work ethic from everybody that I grew up around. So I, I would thank everybody in my community for, for teaching me the value of hard work and having a good work ethic. Wow, well, Paula, yeah, it is really amazing. Paula says a huge key to their genetic genealogy is people publicly offering their DNA results to a website called a uh, Jed match is what helps create the national database to narrow down the list of suspects. Since it began working with law enforcement in 2018, Parabon has been involved in nearly 500 violent criminal cases to date, generating 113 positive identifications for police so far. Well, well you can watch The Genetic Detective tomorrow night at 9 o'clock right here on ABC 25.